Hello everybody, Mikey Darpanzinator here with uh, the super campaign. We need to recall our colonists. We need a lot more, we need more colonies rolling at the same time, that's for sure. Also, let's go check on our trade companies. Have these places been converted yet? Now you're still Sunni. Are these places, okay, so you're Catholic, so you can be added to the trade company, as can you. Alrighty then. I don't know why that sounded so weird. So first things first, we need to spend money. So we're going to upgrade all of our ships. Or all of our main fleets. Okay, so that's actually a good chunk of change right there. Um, next up, we want to do trade company investments. So... I guess we do like state by state probably yeah so I don't know what it's centering on but we'll just keep on building stuff spend all that money on the West African coast see it's a little tricky this interface you have to be in state view, and it just kind of, like Zanzibar, okay, does, uh, does that mean like this? Like Mozambique? Or just part of Zanzibar? I don't know. Regardless, we can build all of this. Ed ed okay, so there we go. Spent a lot of money on trade company investments, and we'll let it tick a day, and we can work on colonizing so let's go here which is good we can't go here or any of this stuff just yet that is still working on that um, I really do think we're gonna be fine here so I'm actually gonna send our colonists to here and to here there we go that is good all right, so we can also interact with the estates. Let's see. Ask for let's grant a monopoly charter, new world charter. Recruit a minister. I'm going to demand diplo support and a bunch of money. Uh, let's see. Let's seek their support. Emissary to the Pope. New World Missions, Admin Support. Alright, so now we have a bunch of other stuff. Let's go to the Maldives. Kind of that's not what they were talking about. Singapore. Let's put a bunch of stuff in Singapore. Maybe it... I don't know what some of this stuff means. I really don't. Oh, and it, it's sending us to the center of the trade company. Of course, that's what it is. Oh. The trade nodes surrounding the trade company. So, we're going to have to find all this crap on our own. It's fine. Just dump money into the problem. We'll improve all of our trade, and that'll vastly improve all of our other stuff. Okay. Okay. We also have another merchant. I think we should, uh... I think we should definitely go to the Ivory Coast. Transfer trade power. I feel like that's a good idea considering, you know, it's like... Yeah, yeah, we should do that. We should definitely do that. Considering we are expanding our presence over here. Aachen has coal. That's good. Coal is good. Coal is very good. Um... Everyone wants their condottieri. Colombia is looking more like Colombia. Mexico needs to... Like, come on. Texas is a fun place. Colonizing Texas. I guess it is slowly colonizing up Mexico. Which is fine. Tax it. Now let's get some points. Also, how the hell... Do you not have... Oh. You can get this now. There we go, better admin points. Free slot. 
This is tricky. What do we want? Probably some of these would be great. This would give us a lot of money. But I do want to convert stuff. Maritime ideas. I think we're going to do trade ideas. And then we're going to get more and we're going to get more and more merchants to transfer trade power. So we'll send someone to the Cape of Good Hope. That'll that'll do. So yeah, we'll just keep trading and make even more absurd amounts of money. But we want to build the Suez Canal, the Kiel Canal, and the Panama Canal. I want to build all the canals. Panama. Organize. Uh, uh, no, no, no relief effort. We don't have money for that. We're just being mean. We never spend money on the relief efforts. Like, eh, you'll live. You will live. And that's like, uh, it's a little, a little harsh, if I must say so myself. So. I don't know. Japan. Dear Japan, why are you not... Why are you not, you know, going to murder people? Well, you have a truce of them. I guess you did just take a bunch from them. Or maybe they lost. Japan might have lost a war. Who knows? Who freaking knows? I know. Look at all these separatists that Benin cannot handle. What's our... Um... a lot of unrest in the world. What the hell is going on here? Zazu. Okay. Oh, look. We got this thing in Louisiana. So now we can go to here. We're, we're getting there. And then we'll get this one. Sue, whatever. And then we have this one coming. We have the general that one. We have the Tierra del Fuego has been colonized. Tierra del Fuego. Gain some innovativeness. Lose some prestige. Eh. That'll do. We can handle a little unrest. Zazu. We can't declare war on them. That's right. That's right. They're at peace. But. Declared war on you. Okay. Let's get a new general. We can actually get two new generals, probably. Alright, so you can just go into there. You can go into there. And then we just do like this whole deal. So we're at war with all these people. First, so we're going to want to make our peace with Benin first. So then we can take Zazu. Although I guess we do have unlimited pouring distance. What do we want? Construct the Kiel Canal. We're going to construct the Kiel Canal. We're not going to cancel it for sure. No. We're not canceling. No cancel. No cancellations. What about here? I don't know what the hell's going on. This looks a, a bit chaotic, if you ask me. So I say we're just gonna... We're a papal controller. Let's spend one papal influence to... I think we'll always be papal controller to some extent. Kiel Canal... Good leadership. Kiel Canal will be done earlier. Okay. I like that. Alright, so let's send you here. Let's send in you up there. These people are just gonna run around like chickens with their heads cut off. Alright, so first I want Zazu. I want all this coastal stuff because it seems to be important. Alright, so let's clear offer. Let's do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Make sure we have Zazu. Yeah, that seems like a good plan. 
Push them to the coasts. Excellent, excellent. <clears throat> okay. Oh, the guns, drums, and steel. <clears throat> Love it. The music's just so good. My Imperator. We are absolutely boat racing them. They will not accept yet, but that's fine. We might have to hunt down their armies, which is going to be a pain. Or if we just completely occupy all of them. Perhaps that's what we'll do. Perhaps that'll be good. Good enough. They will not accept peace yet. Nope. Alright, so you are going to force march. You're going to find those SOBs. Will you accept the peace yet? No, you will not. Because you're dumb. You go there. You force march down that way. We will catch them. I want you to force march and cut them off. That's what we're gonna do. Do 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 do, and you're gonna stay there in case any of them come back. Well, first of all, they're completely occupied, so we'll 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 take their land. Diplo power. Okay. Cascadia Noble Rebels, that's fine. Alright, so, that's one more done. Zazu, well, we need to wait. We need to sue them for peace, of course. Oh, so we're good with you. We're good here. And stop force marching. Stop force marching and just chill. Okay. No, well... Whatever. Zazu! I want your land. And your money. All three ducats of it. So now we can core more stuff. And we'll wait 20 days, and we'll... Yeah, let's go kill these soldiers. D... We probably don't even need a force march. And we'll be the defender. There we go. And for you, I'll take your land and all 15 of your ducats. There we go. Good. So send one of you there and leave one of you here. Send you to Cameroon. I want you just to be ready for any possible revolts. Got some livestock. You got some wool or whatever. Yeah, I think because we, you know, free freeing slaves. Seventeen, seventeen thirty-eight. Is that still a meme? I hope not. I'm like, hey, what's up? Hello. I want your country. Um, okay. Carrying swiftly onward. Louisiana is beautiful. Canada is beautiful. Oh, look at that. I love it. Fill in the name. Make it look bigger. It's all about... It's all about having the biggest name. That's what this game is about. That's what it should be about. It's very... At its very, very least. At the core... So yeah. It'd be nice if there were just a list of trade company improvements. Where you could be like, yeah, let's um let's just do all of this and you know, just like have a list, just like on the normal building queue, like all of yeah. It'd be nice if they had something like this, something like, I'd just build them somewhere. Like I'd still, you know, I'd like the ability to 
you know, if we're not playing a overpowered super global superpower that should be able to conquer the world if I wanted to. No. We should be able to just be like lazily be like, eh, I want everything. Oh, also that probably was our military points. For Militech 25, we are pleased. Base manpower. That's good. More manpower is a good thing. When will this expire? 1725. That's good. Hopefully we'll be able to get another colonist. A colonist for another 10 years. Advisor cost. Whatever. I think we're just making the clergy mad. Yeah, the clergy is very influential and very mad. That's no good. I mean, we are the Roman Empire. We do have to have some level of clergy control. Not control is the wrong word. Influence. Like, we're, we're, we're Rome. We're the Pope. Or the Pope is part of us. I don't know. We contain the Papal States. It's all good. Bunch of uncolonized land. Would like it if we filled in all of... All of this stuff up here. Ooh, what if... I'd also like to fill in the wasteland. The Great Basin. And the wasteland down there. These are hard times. Oh. That's unfortunate. It really is. Let's continue drilling at the capital. Keep our army professionalism up. I don't think this goes down, though. I mean, it could go down. Whatever. Fleet and being. Naval maintenance. Thank God we have that one. Automatically raise maintenance during war. Yeah, slackening recruiting standards doesn't seem like a necessary move when we've never had to worry about... Oh. Stability or reform progress? I don't really care about reform progress. Because what does the last reform do? We can become a republic. Or no, we can become a, theocrat a theocracy. Um, could become a republic. We can do legislative houses, which does what? Add plus one add in policy. Yeah, I don't think this uh, really matters. I don't think that matters that much. But regardless, that is the end of this episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. We actually went to war, which is good. Um, so yeah, we'll just keep spending our money and conquering the world. And good wars, good, 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 good. Take over stuff. Please, everyone, just consolidate. Give me a hard opponent. I'm glad Japan is spreading. I wish we could be in alliance with Japan and help. I would like to ally with Japan and help them conquer everything, but maybe we'll do that. If we completely conquer Africa, we might do that. We might station all of our troops along this border to make sure no one does any funny business. And then, um, you know, send a bunch of troops in Japan and help them, you know, help build Japan into a good rival. But, of course, all this will take place in future episodes. Hope you all enjoy this one. If you did, be sure to consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comments. And of course, special thanks to all of our current subscribers and patrons. Hope to see everybody in the next episode. Until then, this is Mikey Dare Panzernator, signing out. See ya, nerds.